excerpt you saw from Theatre by the River's production of Billy Bishop Goes to War. It's on here at the Ellis Cafe and Theatre until November 16th. And of course with me here now is the lead character, Brent Hirose. I was going to call him Billy again, but it's Brent. Now, watching that, Billy Bishop, of course, is a World War of One flying ace. My mm -hmm. expectation was, you know, a very serious play. This is not a serious play. Uh, no, well, it has a, it has a very tongue-in-cheek uh, aesthetic to it and uh, a great sense of humor while it still discusses all of the horrors of war and all that stuff. And, uh, you yeah, know, Billy Bishop is a, is a great character. Uh, in any other country, like in the States, he'd be canonized, but in Canada, he's almost a marginal figure. People know oh, Billy Bishop, think he was in a war or something. Mm -hmm. But uh, he accomplished some remarkable things in his life under ridiculous circumstances. Um, having to fly these planes that could barely get off into the air. And in doing so, he uh, scored uh, over 70 kills, um, and which made him one of the highest scoring aces in the First World War. I guess that also kind of makes him a controversial figure. He was a great hero, but he was also looked upon as kind of a butcher, I guess. Well, in somewhat, he he was used as a as a figurehead for uh, for the army and uh, during the Second World War, which the play uh, takes place uh, and mostly recounts uh, World War One and then moves up to the beginning of the Second World War, where uh, where Billy Bishop was a, a figurehead for the army who toured across the country and uh, and made speeches for uh, for the recruiters. Mm -hmm. Um, and, uh, and and yeah, so he he really had this this pivotal role that he that he played in the in the country's history and uh, uh, as a figurehead to create morale for the troops on our side. And mm -hmm. yeah. Now you might find it interesting to know that this play was written by somebody you probably know very well. He is. Well, it was written by John Gray with Eric Peterson, and Eric Peterson is uh, better known as uh, the dad on Corner Gas. Oh, so wow. yeah. <laughs> Now this is a m musical, obviously, and mm -hmm. comedy. Why do you think that's such a good fit for Billy Bishop? Well, I think Billy Bishop is this great uh, everyman character, um, and I think the journey that it takes place in this play is he comes from being this schmuck from the middle of uh, from Owen Sounds, Ontario, and uh, gets thrust into the middle of the war, and uh, is sort of like tumbles over ass backwards into uh, into. A uh, becoming this figurehead and this dignitary, and so he has this great sense of humor about what's happening to him because he acknowledges that uh, that he's in over his head, mm -hmm. and I think that makes it really relatable to watch this guy go through uh, this tremendous world event and suddenly find himself being important and being uh, being a strong part of the war effort. Now it's a lot of fun to watch. I mean, of course, you've got two characters essentially. You've got Billy Bishop. And you've got the piano player played by? Uh, played by Patrick Keene. Right. Yeah. So he's actually well, the narrator? Well, he does uh, some narration, some sound effects, um, and uh, a lot of, uh, of, of musical accompaniments that, that goes along with the show. And uh, meanwhile, I'm juggling around Billy Bishop and 17 other characters. Mm -hmm. So uh, while there's not a lot on stage, I think there, there's more than enough to, to keep people <laughs> entertained. And it, it certainly has a, has a lot of challenges and a lot of fun to, to play with. Yeah. Certainly lightheartedness, because in the rehearsal, I think I dropped a coin and that kind of put things off right from the start. <laughs> <laughs> Little giggle. <laughs> All right, so Billy Bishop Goes to War. That's on here at Ellis Street, or Ellis Street uh, Theater and Cafe. Cafe Theater, mm -hmm. Theater and Cafe up until November 16th, and uh, for people wanting to find out more about it, you've got a website? Yeah, you can check it out at www.theaterbytheriver.com. All right. Yeah. Thanks very much, Brent. Thank you. For Shaw TV, I'm Jeremy Bell.